Wayne's grade were putting kids first to deal with your dream scoop. I like this film because it has an amazing mystery and the characters are really cute. It's cool how they have their own opinion about pretty much everything. Yet, they are still really good friends. The film is full of action and also has some touching scenes that will make you feel emotional. This animated film is about a gang that meets on Halloween when they're all young and they solve their first mystery. Then they start solving even more mysteries all the time. When they grow up, they try to find an investor to support their mystery solving business. Simon Cowell, played by Simon Cowell, meets the crew in a diner and says he won't give them any money if Shaggy, Will Forte, and Scooby-Doo, Frank Welker, are part of the business, since he believes a group is only as strong as its weakest link. Shaggy and Scooby go off bowling, but wind up getting chased by evil robots. I know, very random. They get transported to Blue Falcon's Mark Wahlberg ship and meet Dino Mutt, Kang Jong, and Dee Dee Sykes, Kiersey Clemens. A group gets chased by the robots, who are controlled by Dick Dastardly, Jason Isaacs. He's a pretty bad guy that wants to take Scooby and open the gate to the underworld. You'll have to watch to see if Dick successfully opens the gate. All the characters are so funny. Each one has its own little personality, such as Fred, played by Zac Efron. Isn't the smartest guy, but he's definitely the cutest. Velma, Gina Rodriguez, on the other hand, is probably the smartest person you'll ever meet. The group relies on each other to solve problems. To me, that's pretty cool. My favorite part is when Shaggy and Scooby sing Shallow to Simon Cowell. I'm up the deep end, watch as I dive in. Anyway, it is so funny because they are definitely not good singers. But I love it because Shallow is my favorite song. As you can probably tell, the message of the film is to trust your friends. Even when they mess up, you should still have their back. It kind of reminds me that sometimes I mess up and I want my friends to support me still. I give Scoob five out of five stars and recommend it for ages six to 12. I also think adults will like this film, especially if they used to watch the animated shows when they were kids. Scoob is available now online. So go look for it. I'm Kane Scraper, putting the kids first. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss another review. If you want, you can pull over and drop us off here. We'll walk home. I guess our new movie is an origin story. Every hero should have one. I want The Rock to play me. Never gonna happen. <laughs>